I brought you something. My brother gave it to me when I was a little girl. I could never seem to get up on time, so I um, set it for five. Out of bed, you daisy head. Out of bed, you daisy head. It always made me laugh. Out of bed, you daisy head. <laughs> I thought, being away from your convent, that even someone like you could get lonely. Have a seat. So which one are you? Mary Robert. You have a little trouble getting up at 5 o'clock too, Mary Robert? Oh, not now. I get up a half an hour early just to make sure. It's, it's, it's not just the mornings. It's that all my life, everybody seems to be doing or catching on to things a second faster better than me. Yeah, well, everybody's playing catch up nowadays. So, Mary Robert. Did you always want to be a nun? Mm. I always knew that that was my calling, to lead a life of service. But you see, I've always felt that there's something inside me that I, I want to give. Something that's only me and nobody else. Does that sound like a terrible thing? Like pride? No. It doesn't sound like a terrible thing at all. I'm so happy that you've come to join us, Mary Clarence. Do you know how sometimes it's as if you have to be yourself or you'll just burst? Yep, I do. Good night. Good night, Mary Robert. 